Fiero. man some room. Last thing he needs is one of you eggheads on him after the nap that he's had. Cave Johnson, pleasure to meet you, Mr. Choplin. We've learned a lot about you over the last few years. You, my friend, are at none other than Aperture Science, best damn applied science company on Earth. This is the lovely Carolyn, my assistant. Pleasure to meet you, Mr. Joplin. Pretty as a postcard, too. Now, Piero, are you able to stand? So a couple of years ago, I assigned a few of my scientists the task of looking into new and exciting ideas that we could research further. Coincidentally, it's when we found you here. You know, of all your projects, I was instantly drawn to your door to nowhere. Let me tell you, it was a pain to locate. But we finally found your, um... Portable quantum tunneling device. Ah, yes, that's it. Uh, what was left of it, Mr. Mr. Johnson. Please, I... call me Kate. Um, Kate. I stopped that project for a reason. If you really found my research, then you Hero, know. Hero, we know what happened to Christopher. Terrible tragedy. But I'm an advocate for safe science. That kind of thing won't happen again. Too messy. Now, Piero, I'm not going to make you work on the portal initiative. I can't turn back time just yet. But if you prefer to leave, then so be it. Rogers, how long can the new serum sustain a reaction? I'm estimating anywhere between two to five minutes. Really, until we have a better reaction surface. But we would still need a better conversion system. Maybe a new gel. Nothing to report today, Carolyn. Oh, sir, there's some more paperwork for you regarding the missing persons reports. The what? It's miscommunication. It's the same fodder that Black Mesa's been spewing for the last 10 years. Well, we still have the Borealis. The large-scale portal technology is guaranteed to revitalize Aperture. But for the best results, I really need the direct access to the test subject. Piero, we've been over this numerous times. I have staff handling them. I really think I can... That's enough! I've had enough to deal with than to have to hear this from you again! Look into a new gel. I want it by next week.
Well done, everyone. We wanted the best, and I'm happy to say that you're it. What about that guy? Carolyn, take the test subjects up to the exit. Get them their $60. They've earned it. You too. Give Mr. Joplin and I a moment. I'm doing what I have to do in the name of science. I thought you of all people would understand that. Who are you to place science in front of innocent lives? Science isn't about why, it's about why not. Realize that nothing gets done with your tail between your legs. And I still expect that gel by next week. The moon. What? Make that into a gel. You too. Score Mr. Joplin back to his lab. He needs to be under 24-7 surveillance while I work on this theory of his. Mr. Joplin. Yeah. Actually, there's one other thing I need to let Mr. Johnson know. One moment, Mr. Joplin. Let me pull up the board here. Let's move. I know I use this thing. But... Who did you send this to? Mr. Johnson. And who else? You're leaking important information. I don't know exactly what you. I get it. You're not amateur. You're black man. Report received for today. Escort Mr. Joplin to his quarters and let him know we have a new batch of tests coming up tomorrow. Since his progress has been on the decline, I'm sure he won't mind being our test subject. <laughs> She's a beauty, Piero, but she's remained rather still lately. I've given you years. Are your morals still blinding you? <laughs> Wake up. This is science at its greatest. Your brand of science is not something I want to be a part of. Even with moon rock poisoning, I still have my ways to stay on top. Guaranteed to continue the success of Aperture Science far into the fast approaching distant past. Unfortunately for you, Mr. Joplin, your time here is up. Don't shoot him! I have something else in mind for him. Just bring him.
find him! Now! Come in. <coughs> you wanted to see me, Mr. Johnson? Ah, yes, Ratman. How's your research coming? Um, good, sir. Promising. Henry and I are on track to have things ready for testing very soon. <laughs> you understand what this research is for, yes? Of course, sir. Your work is great. I haven't been this impressed since. Can I entrust you with another task? Whatever you need, sir. Good to know. Carolyn? Follow us. We have to go to the daycare center. I'll explain on the way. Don't trust him. When the end comes, find me. Redmond, work on that hustle. 